but I like showing you guys new anime, and last night I found this new series called The Moon is Beautiful, or Kiri Ga Wa Na Ikur Do, I don't know, but it's a really cool and cute anime, and I feel like you guys should definitely go watch it, at least if you're into romance and kind of like the school life vibe like I am. Last night, I binge watched like all seven episodes that have come, and uh, I highly recommend it. I feel like it's not really talked about. Like this season, you got you have Love Tyrant, um, the new Attack on Titan season. You have Dragon Ball Super, and uh, like other series like the Recreators and whatnot. I feel like this has kind of flown under the radar, but I feel like it's a series that like if you're into romance and like slice of life kind of, you should definitely go check out. So the story centers around two junior or third year middle schoolers uh akane and azumi azumi is this kind of reserved shy bookworm like he's cool around guys but you know typical uh you know adolescent teen you know he's kind of shy around girls and uh actually he's really shy around girls uh and uh he's just really into books and literature and then you have I said, uh, Akane. Akane is kind of this reserved girl, but she's popular and she uh, she runs track and she's really good at track. And so she has a lot of friends in that. And like, so it, they're kind of, these two characters are kind of similar. And um, basically, it's just a love story between the two of them. And it's a really cute thing to watch because you see their love starting to blossom and it's in a, like that middle school kind of way. Um, and it, it's just like, you know, it's still kind of like that innocent love. What the series does well is it excels in its simplicity because, <laughs> and realistic, it's very realistic because, um, so I know personally, whenever I was in middle school, back in those days, if I had a girlfriend, I was extremely awkward around her. Like, I dreaded walking into class and seeing her. I didn't know how to approach her, how to talk to her. So I, I probably ended up not talking to her. It's probably why I didn't. So, but nowadays, like, I have a girlfriend. I mean, you guys have probably known her if you've seen this channel. And, uh, like, I'm, I fart on, like, a consistent basis in front of her. Like, there is, there's no shyness nowadays. But the point is, um, that's, like, at least I think other people like that, too. You feel awkward around them and shy in real life. But a second you get away from them and you're on your phone, you guys can text nonstop and, like, talk about everything. And that's what happens in this series. So these two characters, Azumi and Akane, um, they, they're they like that. They uh, start to develop feelings for each other and stuff. And like, it's kind of hard for them to talk in real life. But when they're in school, uh, I mean, when they're outside of school, uh, they text each other constantly. It's like, it's just one of those feel-good stories. You watch it and you're kind of like smiling as you see their love continue to blossom. And like... I don't know, you see the way that, uh, uh, like, Azumi acts, like, you know, he's celebrating, like, as he continues to, um, progress in the relationship with her, and it's just seeing them smile and seeing them cherish those kind of memories and stuff, really, uh, it just brings you back, and it's, like, it's one of those feel-good series because you're watching it, and you're just happy to see them, uh, like, their love grow, so if you're, like, kind of bored, you're looking for a feel-good series that's gonna make you kind of smile and just make your heart smile, then uh, you guys should definitely go check it out. Really cool artwork. Uh, I like the style of the series, and I don't know, it's just one of those feel-good romance, kind of young love stories. That, yeah, guys, and of course it also goes around the drama that comes about, you know, young love and stuff. And uh, So right now there's like seven episodes out, so it's not too late to catch up, binge watch it. Thank you for the continued support. Stay strong, love yourselves, and uh, peace.